hello everyone this is Imran Ali here welcome back to our channel and today we are going to talk about how to add WooCommerce cart icon to your menu so right now you can see we are at wordpress.com and uh, first of all we were talking about WooCommerce uh, menu cart right so just remember go to your plugins add new and search for WooCommerce and when you install that it will end up over here on the left side of this menu so you can see over here this is WooCommerce right before you uh, like add a uh, cart menu you know so right now first of all we need to understand why we need cart so what does it mean like add to cart so the cart like the add to cart card button is a feature for e-commerce stores mostly so why because it allows customers to choose items to purchase without actually completing the payment so for example for online stores it lives in uh, individual product page and uh, functioning as the digital equivalent of a shopping cart in a brick and mortar store so there are two options like uh, on usually stores they choose two options uh, add to cart and buy now so what's the difference between add to cart and buy now so it means like you are putting some items like in add to cart which you want to buy so but buy now like but you may buy them in near future so it's, it's like that uh, you will buy that in future but buy now like it sounds like buy now means you are buying it right now so add to cart is very useful for e-commerce uh, stores so right now we are going to tell about a free plugin which you can choose for your WooCommerce menu card so what is that go to your plugins uh, click on add new after clicking on add new you will end up over here so you can see there are multiple plugins out here so what do you need to write over here click on it WooCommerce um, menu card simple right so once you search for it you can see we have so many options over here so which option you are going to choose right so on the top you can see we need WooCommerce for like to activate menu card right and the third option is WooCommerce cart abandoned uh, abandonment recovery but you don't need this obviously if you scroll down over here you can see WP overnight this is by WP overnight and uh, menu card for WooCommerce so it's very simple and once you click on more details you can you can find more details related to it like display card icon or only item prices display items only or prices or both you know there are some so much uh, uh, features which you can choose and uh, take advantage of it you can see like float left float right uh, use your menu default settings customize your own CSS but these are free version right obviously it has their pro version included like over here as you can see but we will talk about this later so just leave it for now why because I will show you like all of this and if you scroll down over here you can just download your pro version over here we will talk about this later also I'm just going to open this to my next tab so we can remember that right and uh, you can see all the uh, like translations they are providing you and compatibility so WooCommerce uh, plugin you need that and easy digital downloads so that's it just click on install now wait for it as you can see over here and installed right click on activate and it will take you right over here all your plugins will over here will be over here and if you scroll down over here like over here you can see it has been activated WP menu card and click on settings so it will take you to the settings right so here you can see there are multiple menu options over here and we are going to explain like what it does right so our first option over here as you can see select e-commerce plugin you would like to menu card to work with so I told you you need WooCommerce for this uh, right for this plugin so once you go over there if sometimes uh, it shows up like this so you can just go over here and click on WooCommerce right second option is select the menus in which you want to display the menu card so let's just suppose I have um, over here you can see this is my website for this tutorial right and you can see I have some uh, menu on the top so you can see I can add that on the menu and if you want to add to more pages and more areas that add to cart option and that to that add to cart icon 
so you can do that but unfortunately it is not available in free version as you can see these both are off second uh, third option is always display card even if it's empty yes and uh, show on card and checkout page you can also enable that but again it's a pro version and if you scroll down display sh shopping card icon yes display card contents in menu flyout if you want to check that you can do that but unfortunately it is also unavailable for you know free version set maximum number of products to display it doesn't matter but you can see it's also a pro version and this is where you will feel like you need a pro version why because you can see there are multiple icons over here but you can only choose the first one for free versions you will need a pro version for all of these so this is a downfall for this plugin but for starter i guess it's okay this is not bad even and you can see what would uh, would you like to display in the menu like both prices and items like uh, prices only or items only so it's all on you it's like the alignment that looks the best for your menu like default menu if you want to go with that or live left right if you want go want to go with that it's all on you last one price to display and enter your custom uh, css class you can also add that also and then obviously click on save changes so it's done it's literally that easy to add uh this add to card icon to your website so let's talk about the uh, pro version like how much they cost right so i'm just going to show you that website which i have told you about right so once you click on that uh, link which i have already copied and pasted over here you will end up over here and you can see on the right side like what they are actually offering and there are some things which you can see and read and once you buy pro there are more plugins which it can work with like woocommerce eshop wp ecommerce uh, easy digital downloads and jaco shop you can see more like more uh, features they are providing but we are going to talk about this pricing right so you can see over here like for one site license you need 29 euro and uh, you can use every single thing they are providing for three sites you need 15 60 uh, euro and 25 sites you know after some you know if you add more side you will end up getting more money right uh you can add your own custom if you want only one menu and uh, one side license plus custom css it costs around 40 euro so starter for starter i guess you need to go ahead and choose free version otherwise you can see there are some pro version also over here so i'm going to show you over here like uh, obviously you can see i have already saved changes but I'm going to show you that how it looks like. So you can see over here this card, right? So I had just refreshed this page and you can see on the top right corner how it looks like now. So this is my item and this is my money. And I, if I click on any on a, one of them, you can see I can add that over here. If I click on it, it will take you right over here and you can just proceed to check out. It's very that easy. So I believe you will end up learning something from this video and uh, it's very easy. Just go ahead and click on plugin, add the plugin which is called WooCommerce menu card. And after that, go follow my steps. And if you want more, uh, like more icons, you will end up getting pro version. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you understand every single thing. Please leave a like and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye.